In an interview conducted with Peyton Reed, the director of the Ant-Man trilogy, by Yahoo after the release of Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania, the director already has ideas and teases some of the story elements that could play into Ant-Man 4 if the film happens. So again, this comes at us directly from Yahoo, except it's Yahoo Entertainment UK that conducted the interview with Peyton Reed, and specifically asking him about Ant-Man 4, since he's hinted at it before and whether he has any ideas, he says that in his mind, it has to do a lot more with the quantum realm, specifically going back and forth between the quantum realm and the normal world and seeing how things are happening between both locations and also introducing characters that could be very formidable and put a different spin on the Ant-Man legacy. Now, previously we heard that there was ideas to use Black Ant that never materialized because of the changing direction of Ant-Man 3. So it would kind of make sense if maybe that came into play and they did push Black Ant as sort of a, you know, mirror image of Ant-Man, but you push it differently. Maybe he's coming from the quantum realm out of it and they're trying to carry some sort of contraband or something because you always got it for some reason with the Ant-Man movies do the heist thing in some regard. So I think you could come up with something here. And he says that no matter what they do, though, that Cassie will be at the center of it because of the Cassie-Scott relationship and that that's really the key. So as the MCU continues to grow, they will obviously introduce more villains and more heroes. But one thing's for sure, Ant-Man will remain a family film and that they're finding a way if they get to Ant-Man 4 to make it another entry in the whole family saga and what you do with it. So again, I think there's something here. I would not be surprised and I'm just going to take a guess here, if maybe they do Black Ant, but Black Ant is a variant of Scott from another universe, maybe he lost everything and just becomes pure evil and corruption. That way you still tie it into the whole multiverse thing, but it's a leftover, it's in the quantum realm, he could utilize that technology. Like, there's something there, and him kind of teasing that they want to go back and forth with the quantum realm and deal with the ramifications of it, I think could be really interesting on the bigger whole sort of scale on how does this work in terms of the impact it has on the MCU because it would have to have some sort of impact on the bigger picture considering the quantum realm can be used for time travel. You know, there's things here you could put into play that work.